Welcome to the Android channel and um, this is a quick video to show you how to install Navi X for XBMC. Uh, this is for Android because this is an Android channel but it's um, pretty much the same way of going around throughout multiple devices. First you have to go to the website that is called code.google.com slash p slash navi x slash downloads slash list if that's too long for you just google navi x download and you'll be sent to this web page it should look like this and you've got the different release of navi x um, so the latest one is dated June 15th on this video and it is Navi X 37.8 uh, Navi X is a media streaming add-on and it really really lets you uh, go through different sources on the web to get all sorts of content so what you do is you first of all click the Navi X zip file what you have to remember is where it is downloaded in your Android or whatever device you are using you really need to know where to follow it because you'll need to access this file with the XBMC program at all so you click on it and you start downloading it uh, most of the downloads on the Android devices go into a folder that's called download so you have to remember that once it's downloaded, all you'll have to do is, of course, go to your XBMC Media Center. And once you're in your XBMC Media Center, you'll go into Programs. And there you have Add Source or Program Add-ons. So you can click Program Add-ons. You'll click Get More. you can look at what's available here on the get more list or you can actually just simply go if we go back to the uh, page that we were um, install from zip file this is what you want you'll click install from zip file and you'll have to go into your device and see where you have downloaded the file so for example here I've downloaded in external storage in a place called download and you see Navi X is right here when you do that you'll actually have the add-on enabled as you see on the bottom right Navi X add-on enabled that means it works and you can now go back into the program section so if you want to use it, basically, let's go back home. You'll have to go to Programs, and you'll get your Navi X right here. So everything works well. You should get to this page with Media Portal and stuff. Uh, it will have different icons uh, as time goes by and as um, the device is freshly installed. Of course, you'll have. You'll have to wait for all the streaming and the content available to arrive to your um, device and here you go slowly you get these icons showing up um, and then you'll have the Navi X networks where you can get TV shows, movies, music, podcasts, uh, pictures, all sorts of stuff, apps all you have to do is if you want to search for a TV show for example you'll click TV shows and you have the different sources where you can get the TV shows so all you have to do is click on the network where you want the TV shows now um, one of the negative side of um, Navi X on a slower device like I have here is that it sometimes sometimes takes a long long time to actually list what you're searching for so if you are clicking on movies for example uh, I've seen this list here these please wait uh, going on for 10 minutes before something showed up 
because this device is not very performance uh, enhanced wise but it does work and be patient and you'll eventually go and uh, see all the content now the uh, negative side of the con of the Navi X is the fact that a lot of the content is unavailable and uh, I've actually um, tried many movies many TV shows and uh, I would say it's really a hit and miss stuff you go you click or you search for a, a, a movie or something and it can take um, you know a few minutes and it's gonna tell you well I'm sorry my content is not online it's not available so um, Navi X used to be real nice and you could really really see a lot of content but lately it's been very very um, I would say very unreliable um, I also noticed that on version 3.7.8 um, it's been crashing more so um, what you want to do is actually make sure that uh, everything you have is uh, pretty much everything you have is um, at the latest version and uh, it depends probably also a lot on your own um, device so Navi X something it's a nice little add-on you can have for your XBMC um, media center um, even though the content is kind of difficult to have, I, I, I would still download it and I still want it installed um, and check from time to time as they find new sources uh, you will have enhanced um, you can have enhanced sources and maybe find that movie or that TV show uh, it's really a hit and miss situation though so good luck with it, I hope you uh, have fun, hope it works well uh, give me your idea do you have content that's easier um, maybe it's different depending on the countries we live in also uh, be careful you are accessing most of the time with Navi X some illegal stuff and so um, you might get into trouble if you're not careful so if you enjoy our videos click the subscribe button and you'll be uh, informing new videos online if you have any comments or questions on what you've seen let us know Maybe you have a Android feature you'd like us to talk about. Let us know also. We'll try to uh, put a video online. or uh, And you'll be helping others at the same time. And uh, hope you enjoy our videos. And come back to this Android channel. Bye-bye.